Now welcome to Survive on a Budget Made Easy. We're going to be taking a look at the corn on the cob from Walmart, the great value brand. I didn't even know this stuff existed until the other day. And to be honest, I can't remember how much I paid for it, but I know they're out of stock now. But the instructions are, are real simple. I'm not going to do it in the microwave, but I'm going to do it on the stove top. In a large pot, cover frozen corn on the cob with water, bring to a boil, reduce heat and simmer for four to five minutes and until desired doneness. I'm not sure how you're supposed to know when it's done to desired doneness without taking it out, putting it back in, taking it out, putting it back in. But we're gonna do the best we can. I just got me a small pot. I'm only gonna make a few pieces. And each cob it says 80 calories, which I think is a lot of calories, to be honest. I'm gonna go ahead, bring that to a boil. Okay, we're going to go ahead, put the heat on high, and bring that to a boil. Okay, I'm not sure, but I think I forgot to hit record. Uh, it came to a boil, I slid it over, and I set the timer for five minutes. Right now, we're down to about three minutes. Okay, it's been five minutes. Go ahead and take a piece of this out. Well, I can tell right now it's kind of mushy. I think I'll go ahead and take it all out of the water. We're going to go ahead and let that cool off for a while. Hopefully it stiffens back up. Okay, it's been about three minutes or so. It stiffened up a little bit. You can see how mushy it is. I don't like that. I don't know. If I cooked it too long, um, it doesn't have that great of a taste to it. And like I said, it's mushy. It's like eating moss. I, I can't think of anything good to say about it. So, I'm going to say if you see this in Walmart, it's a definite pass. Unless you have a better way of cooking it, let me know. If you know how to cook it so it turns out good, please let me know. Drop a comment down below. Right now, I'm giving this a solid zero. It's not chili cheese dog bad, but it's pretty bad. Okay, do me a favor, click on that subscribe button, and as always, thank you for watching.